Hi everyone, this is K Pandit from Little Montessori Pandits. I spent the Saturday afternoon making this simple in between season wreath and I've used materials from my garden. It took just about an hour to finish the whole thing. The good thing about this wreath is that it's very easy to make, very simple and you can decorate it as you go into different seasons and celebrations. To make this wreath you will need some willow twigs, florist wire, a wire cutter and a cutter. I collected some sprigs from my overgrown box shrub so I cut them into about five to six centimeter in length. I had saved some willow twigs after I had trimmed my willow arch. I'm starting by making a base for the wreath. So I've got few willow twigs in my hand. By bending it I'm going to make a ring. Willow is very versatile so you can bend it the way you want it to be. Some people take one or two twigs at a time and I've got quite a few but I'm using twigs that are thin not very thick and are of the same size and the length. You need about a meter long willow twigs but remember always have the same thickness and the same length. So I'm just twisting it, bending it and with the help of the florist wire I am tying the twigs together and I'll do it a couple of times. It, the first part is rather difficult but then it gets much easier and so there are so many different ways of making the base so this is the way I make it but when I'm making this base with children I make it in a very different way which is what I will show you in my next video Once you have made the ring that is the base for the wreath, any excess twigs you can trim them off. Still had some willow twigs left so I'm just wrapping it around so taking it in out and in out and just wrapping it around the ring. That's just to make it much more thicker. So here I have my base for the wreath. Next thing is to cut all the box sprigs in 5 to 6 cm length. And then you make a small bunch of about 4 or 5 sprigs together. And you start layering it around the ring. And secure it by wrapping the florist wire around it you don't cut the wire you keep it on so every time you take a bundle and you just wrap that bundle around the ring and then you make a second bundle and then you start layering on top of each other until you reach the other end of the ring So making sure that uh, you have a nice full ring so if you think that there is a little bit of space 
then you just keep layering it even underneath as well so you get a lovely full ring you continue layering the box sprigs until both the ends meet I have nearly finished the wreath now I'm going to turn it around and at the back I'm just going to weave in the wire a couple of times in the ring the twigs and then twist it a couple of times and then just tuck it in that's all you do with the wire cutter just cut the wire and that's it here you have your in between season wreath and you can decorate it as you want so for spring summer or for any other occasion do join me next time i'll be sharing with you how to make simple willow twig wreath with children if you have liked this video then press the like button and if you have not subscribed to this channel then please do so until next time be safe